about that already? Yeah. That's the golden death mask of King Tut. Uh, his name actually is Tut Ankh Amun, which means it's three words. Amun means the name of a god. Ankh means life. And Tut means um, the, uh, a representation of. So his name actually means the living representation of God. Or his particular God that he cared about. He actually changed his name. His name actually was Tut Ankh At Atun. And he said, no, I don't want to be named after that guy. Because his father was monotheistic. And they went back to the polytheism and changed it back to the main God of their religion. So I also heard that he... Uh, his father, or they believed to be his father, was following Aten. Yeah. You know what? Why is that one more... Looks, that one looks a little more cooler than that one. Cooler? You think that one's cooler? I think they're both equally pretty cool. I guess it's a matter of taste. Did you eat that? No, I wouldn't eat it. That's not what I mean when I say taste. Preference, I suppose. Preference. Okay, this is a map of Egypt, right? So this is the Nile Lower Egypt. So there's a mountain here and the river's running actually north up into the Mediterranean. And this is right around the area where, where am I at? Egypt, sorry, Cairo is around this area. Look what I pulled out of my pants. That's a little piece of string. So this is the Nile, so this is the river. So the reason why there was people here because even though it's like out in the sand, they were actually right near on the water. So there was like crops and animals and vegetation and society. Why are there little plants right there? Well, these were different little spots where there was uh, water and they could live closer to there. An oasis is a place where there's life growing up out in the middle of a desert. So that's in the middle of a desert? That's in the middle of the desert. So this is all sand surrounding these green areas. The water, as you can see, makes the, the area around it very green with life, and vegetation, and plants. So people live close to the river. They don't like to live out in the middle of nowhere. Should we go look for mommy? And why exactly does that have just a little bit of grass? Well, because some parts of the river are thinner than other parts. But as you can see, it goes and spills into the uh, Mediterranean Sea there. Rowan, I think your dad wants to go find your mom. Hey, can you shake my hand, pal? 